Joe Beermaster here. Today we're doing a review on our DeWalt Buffer Polisher DW849. This is a real great buffer. It's got a 7 to 9 inch buffing pad. It is variable speed. You control speed through this button here. And the speed goes from 600 to 3500 RPM. It's a 12 amp buffer, which gives you plenty of power and it will last a long time. So today we're working on a paint job here, taking some of the nibs out along the quarter panel and door, and we're gonna do a little wet sanding and then we're gonna polish it up with some compound and polish and bring it back real nice using the DeWalt buffer. DeWalt has also come out with orbitable polishers so but this is more used for compound the polisher would be you know something you might want to use on the finishing stages of polishing the paint but like I said this is heavy duty it's good for the professional if you're not a professional you can get a cheap one like maybe at Harbor Freight it won't last long if you're a pro but um, but if you're a professional body shop or detail shop this is the kind of thing you're looking for Take a look at this, got a nice handle. It's got the brushes in there, you have to replace once in a great while. Nice big head on it. it does come with a Velcro head, you can change the head. Or you get the sticky Velcro pads, or you can get the other type. This is the Velcro type, you can see it's Velcro backing. Velcro head, you can change that. You get the kind of screws on, but I do like the Velcro. So. That's what I prefer. Just buy a buffing pad and it sticks right on like that. We're going to do a little polishing and a little buffing and we'll see how this turns out. So there it is, the job's complete. The job is nice and shiny. I like the buffer. It's pretty good. Now that buffer is actually five years old. I do want to mention that it did have a bearing noise in it. I've had some Makita buffers that last 15, 20 years without any hearing any bearing noise, but that buffer was actually bought used. So I'm just noting that, so I don't know what the history was on it. And uh, it's getting a little dark, but did a nice job. Now the orb orbital ones, I've, I haven't had experience with, but this one did just a fine job. And uh, I think I'm going to buy another one because I really like it. I like the speed. And I like the weight of it. The weight was a little bit on the heavier side, but that's something I actually liked, believe it or not. Alright, it's Joe Beermaster. Thanks for watching, and please subscribe.